Hi guys. It feels like I haven't filmed in so long. Um, <laughs> my voice so is not back to normal. But yeah, it literally like at least to me feels like I kind of fell off the face of the earth. <laughs> um, but yep, as you can tell by the title of the video. I got COVID, so that's why I all of a sudden disappear and do not post any more Vlogmas videos. Um, yeah, so today I thought I would share my experience with COVID and just like the Simpsons, Simps I don't know if I can say that word, but you know what, like how it was for me, everything like that. I'm getting better. Um, I'm close to better, but I'm not like fully better. So let's suck off with my last video I posted. When was that? That was okay. I'm looking at my notes because I actually wrote down like how I was feeling every day. So I posted that on December 9th, and um, I filmed that. Wait, no, no, I posted that December 10th. I filmed that video December 9th. Okay, so that was the first, I would say, like, kind of first day, but not really, where, like, I started to, like, realize there was something different, like, with my voice. Like, I kind of felt like it was dry, and at first I was like, oh, maybe just because I'm talking a lot, like, I'm posting more videos, you know, talking more, but clearly that wasn't it. Um, but yeah, that was, like, Friday, and then Saturday was when, like, it just went downhill real quick. Um, so that day, I woke up. Actually, I slept that night. So Friday into Saturday, I slept like probably like close to twelve hours. I felt exhausted, and then it was so hard for me to get up a bag but like I eventually got out of bed and then I eventually you know took a shower but like after that I just felt like I had literally no energy, energy at all like the closest I could like describe how it felt was like when after I had my season I just felt like I had no energy like it was close to that feeling I was like I can't do anything like I just want to lie down here and sleep for the rest of the day. And that what I did for a walk of Saturday as I slept. I did watch some Christmas movies. So that's like the one good thing was like I got to watch a lot of Christmas movies like I want you to do. Um, some of them were bad. But yeah, actually let's go back. So as of now, like what we saw where we got it from and it was sadly from back of all we're pretty confident um just knowing more information and it makes me sad because i was so excited for back of all, and i saw am it's just like the first practice like this would happen like it just makes me you know sad but um actually so what is interesting is both of my parents went to basketball practice and my mom actually got COVID as well, but my dad did not. So that is very interesting. So me and my mom has been uh, quarantining in the living room. Um, so that's been like us just watching like Christmas movies and just not going out anywhere. <laughs> in the house just staying in the living room pretty much the whole time and also like trying to keep my guy out because we realized after like we got I like I got an email from my doctor after I told them that and the email said like something about packs so then I'm like oh my god now I'm scared like keep my guy away from me because I don't want anything to happen to him you know I'm just being safe but yeah so we were basically in one room for over a week pretty much like a week um but like the good news is like there was we had the christmas tree um so you know i'm thinking by a give you know but yeah so that was day one really was saturday i would say and okay let me just see on my nose so yeah i said oh okay yeah barely no energy but another thing was my throat on my mouth whatever like it felt like it was on fire it literally felt like burning like 
I don't even know. It was the worst feeling ever. And that's lasted about, I don't know, I feel like over time it obviously got better, but that was the worst day on Saturday, I would say. And yeah, so I slept a lot. I, yeah, this past week I slept a lot, took a lot of naps, which is very unusual. Jewel for me because I never take naps. So the fact that I took like a bunch of naps is tells you like how COVID impacted me. Um so yeah. And I I believe it was the Omicron variant because when I look up the like symptoms, they the ones I have they mask pretty well with the Omicron. So that what I believe. I got one of the variants. I honestly don't know. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, my, actually my mom, she tested twice. So I believe, was it Friday? Or was it Saturday? I don't know. She tested one of those days and she actually showed up negative. But then she tested on Monday and she showed up positive. And at that point, you know, we were both pretty sick. Um, so, yeah. And then I didn't test because we assume, like, obviously I have it. But I didn't test a call after I know my doctor. And then they really wanted to know, like, for sure if I have it. Because, you know, maybe for some odd reason I didn't get it. But, like, I'm pretty sure I got it, you know. But I did test on Wednesday. And then it obviously so up positive. Which I was, like, 99.9% get one. So... Yeah, so that was Wednesday, and I'm like, I, it, like, all the time, you know, every day, I got, like, a little bit of um, so, like, day, what's it, day three, the 11th, you know, I feel like my voice is starting to get a little bit like, like I said, I still feel like my voice is not back, but my voice did, like, like, it was, it felt like, it still felt hard to speak, like, it, I definitely, like, it was hard for me to even speak, um, so, yeah, and then I said, so my throat, throat started to feel better after day three, like, it wasn't back to normal, but, like, that burning, like, on fire feeling, I don't even know how else to describe it, like, that got better, and then my energy started to get better as well, um, over time, um, but I saw, like, I had low energy, but nothing compared to Saturday, really the first day like that was like I couldn't move anywhere like it was I had no energy at all um and then oh okay and then probably like the biggest one was um so this happened at like oh wait what I saw okay so day three I started to have a cough and this cough um was one of the worst things like the worst things so like in terms of like looking back like i wasn't coughing like non-stop like when i was like lying down like sitting like i don't know watching tv like i it was more like what i can like recall recall it was more of uh, when i was sleeping or like you know trying to take a nap like i would all of a sudden like wake up and cough for like five minutes straight, like non-stop, like can't stop coughing. That, like I dealt with that for so many nights, so many like times where I was trying to nap. Um, and it has gone by, uh, like I feel like it's pretty much gone, like the last like couple nights. I haven't dealt with it. I saw like casually cough, but nothing compared to like coughing non-stop. Like, that is something I dealt with for a while, like, for a while, and it was awful. It was, it was awful. It was terrible. <laughs> um, so that happened, didn't happen right away. So that's starting on day three. And then day, oh, and that night was the worst night of sleeping. Like, before that, I was sleeping fine throughout the night, but that night, I was coughing on shop and then my nose started to run um throughout like the week I was saying in terms of like, my nose running it actually hasn't been that bad um it but when I was coughing 
that's when like my nose started to run but overall it hasn't been too bad but that night specifically um gay three into gay four like I was <laughs> it was the worst it was literally the worst I did not sleep well at all I no <laughs> um so yeah so that so gay four was definitely a lack of um I said I woke out off a cough, like literally it was terrible. I, it was terrible. Um, and then I also was starting to sneeze, so I started sneezing. Um, but I don't feel like that was bad. That bad. It was mostly the cough that was the worst thing. The worst. It was the worst. Um, but my sore throat what was getting better. So yeah, it was definitely getting better. Um, but yeah, and then that night I woke down that I slept better, but I saw I'm coughing. And then day five, so Tuesday the 13th, I started to feel like I was getting better, like my cough was getting better, and also my appetite because of, you know, the, like, not having energy and all that stuff and everything I was dealing with. Like, I wasn't having an appetite, but it was getting better. Like, I was eating more, but saw, like, I, I was new. Like, I'm not back to normal. Like, I saw feel, you know, not great. Um, so, that was Tuesday. So, then Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, I feel like it was kind of like the same in a way. Like I feel like each day I was getting better, like my throat was getting better, my cough was getting better, and everything like that. Um, so yeah, and now it is Sunday. So today is technically day 10. Um, and I definitely sort of not feel like I'm normal at all. And yeah, I'm probably am gonna take a test soon but I may wake away of it because it so probably will say positive I don't know I don't know how long um that will be but obviously like I do not feel good like going anywhere like a car I am negative so yeah that is overall like my experience with COVID like what I dealt with the cough was the worst um there was some other things like a fever I'm not so, like, I'm, I'm not so sure I had a fever. Like, there's a chance in the very beginning I did, but I, I'm, I, I don't, I'm not sure about that. But, yeah, I didn't have, like, any headaches. Like, I'm not the po type of person that has headaches, to be honest with you. Like, I never get headaches, so that is not surprising. I am so, you know, glad that I am vaccinated, that I have all the boosters that I can possibly get at this point because I do believe it would have been a lot worse if I was not vaccinating and that was definitely something I was so scared in the beginning of COVID um before the vaccine I was super super careful because I knew if I ever got it it would be bad it would be bad and um even though you know I still got pretty sick from it I I know the vaccine you know, helped me to not get like super sick and to the point that like I had like I have to go to the hospital. I'm so grateful for that. But yeah, I thought I, thought I would say my experience and especially since I kind of like disappeared. And yeah, so I'm sad that like it ruined Vlogmas, but um what can you do, you know? Hopefully I will, you know, have a few more videos um before the end of the year we'll see we'll see i'm sure i get them back to normal so yeah but you know stay safe out there i know there's a lot of things going around not just covid so stay safe um stay healthy and just be careful out there um yeah and hopefully you know i'll see you soon in my next video bye